of Super Bowl 48 here in New Jersey when it was all said and done kickoff at 49 degrees 10 degrees warmer than Super Bowl six so the supposed cold weather Super Bowl wasn't even the coldest on record Richard Sherman watching Joe name it that's the, the way you go that's the, coin, the way you go but Terry McCauley stopped him got the coin in the air because he wanted to make sure there was heads and tails was called and then Joe flipped the ball in the air and the Seahawks won the toss but put their defense out on the field that love that the tone right there to let you know we come to play and we come to play defense first and then the first snap of the game goes into the end zone it looked like Peyton Manning was audibly but the center snaps the football no Sean Marino hops on it 12 seconds into the game and it's it to 12 men already had an effect the right? 12 sorry, men 12 right. seconds into the game leads to two points right off the bat the quickest score in the history of the right? Super Bowl as Manny Ramirez snapped it before Manning was ready next Seahawks possession with some quality field position here's Percy Harvin around the edge oh. we were wondering what factor he would be 30 quick yards right there in he the made first a quarter difference, rich he made a huge difference he stretched that defense wide and let Marshawn Lynch hit him in the middle but the Broncos defense held him to just three it's five nothing later in the first quarter when that's Doug Baldwin 37 yards but again the Broncos defense bent did not break it's just eight nothing so Peyton Manning has a chance to march down the field and just make it a one-point game except on third and seven he throws it high to Cam Chancellor Bad throw, bad read, great play by Cam Chancellor. Uh, pressured and by started, Cliff Averill. And I thought I started sensing intimidation right around here. This You're right, early. Mike. This I, early. I mean, you got a nice lane. You stepped up in the pocket. Misread that is a horrible and, throw. And, and, and the effort by Julius, I mean, maybe he was in a bad position, or maybe there was some pain coming. And that turnover would be turned into points thanks to a pass interference call in the end zone. Seattle fans have remember Super Bowls where the pass interference in the end zone was called on their receiver, not the defender. That put the ball on the one yard line this time. And then Marshawn Lynch, there's that action boss right up the middle for the <laughs> touchdown. 15 nothing Seattle. So it's time for Denver to do something positive. And they are on the plus side of the field with three minutes to go in the half. When Manning is hit as he throws, Malcolm Smith with the pick. And it's a pick six for Malcolm Smith, 22 to nothing, Marshall. You, you know, uh, Kurt Warner talked about Peyton throwing interceptions and how it would affect his game. It was the one thing, the one thing that could not happen if Denver was going to win. And guess what? A pick six really changed the landscape of this game. Cliff Averill was getting to Manning that got him uh, to throw it. And hit his arm as he threw it and Manning down 22 points right before the half maybe get some points before the half with a minute to go in the half but Peyton Manning cannot complete to Demarius Thomas 22 to nothing was your score when Bruno Mars took the stage but third quarter Bruno Seattle remember job, remember Seattle deferred yep. now they get the ball and Percy Harvin is down yeah. out the gate Guess what, Prime? What? It was just 12 seconds into this half uh, that they scored two. Uh, uh, we, see this, we see this catching the ball off the bounce. And normally when a ball bounces, it migrates all the defensive players together. And that's all Percy Harvin needed. 87 yeah. yards, the 12th man watching them score 12 seconds into each half of Super Bowl 48. Peyton Manning down 29 nothing trying to go for all Demarius Thomas offensive broken pass up. Offensive interference as well. And that was just perfect position by that Richard. That was offensive pass interference. They should have called it. Yeah, we talked about that matchup and who would win and uh, Sherman played very well today. So Peyton now 29 to nothing. Six minutes to go in the third quarter. There's a nice catch by Demarius Thomas except he doesn't hold on to the ball and who's on the spot but Malcolm Smith. They they hit, you know you, you want to call that sloppy play but they when you look at the ridge. replay such a great play by Mac heads up play by Maxwell right there. That's what you need to do. Every time the Broncos yep. seem like they got it going, the ball bounced the other way. Those turnover Thursday is what they practice. Turnover Thursday. And the play fake to Marshawn Lynch after the turnover. What a throw. Russell Wilson to lock it. 19 yard gain. Next play on the Broncos 23. Uh, it's time for Wilson to go find himself some curse on first and 10. 23 yards. And uh, uh, this, kid, this kid is one of those yeah. kids undrafted 
that, that yep. you heard Richard Sherman talk about. Nobody wanted him. Pete Carroll takes him in, and look what, ha what happens. And it, it doesn't matter who Russell Wilson is throwing the football to. They all put their bodies on the line, on the and line. they make those catches. And the run after the catch is always special yeah, for them. And it's 36 to nothing. And you know what's a factor of 36? 12. 12. <laughs> There's 12s everywhere. 36 nothing. When finally the Broncos get on the board with no time left in the third quarter to make it 36 to 7. So we would not have a shutout in Super Bowl 48. It's 36 to 8 as Demarius Thomas sets the records for most receptions in a Super Bowl. But Doug Baldwin, your X Factor from the NFC Championship I game, love Marshall. This, I love this kid, man. Made it a 40 burger in Super Bowl 48. Everything that they, they that they do with Percy Harvin, this kid can do it. Every time Percy's out, he steps in, whether it's in a return game or receiver, and delivers for the Seahawks. And Richard Sherman finished the game on crutches. Pete Carroll oh. is a Super Bowl-winning head coach, getting a hug from Russell Wilson, who he drafted in the third round just two third years round. ago. And that man has still one Super Bowl ring, while Malcolm Smith has a Super Bowl MVP and a trophy to boot. So how about them apples? All of these turnovers, a torrent of turnovers, four of them by Denver, as the Seattle Seahawks come into MetLife Stadium and score on a kickoff return for a touchdown, an interception return for a touchdown, a rushing touchdown, and a passing touchdown, pretty much every which way you can put it in for six. The Seattle Seahawks did that tonight in Super Bowl 48, and it is time for the 12s in Super Bowl 48 to celebrate.